Hey guys, this is Melissa, Nano of Seven Crafts. This is my collaboration with Crafts by Crashly. I'm going to put you on a time lapse and we're going to be kitting up this diamond painting. We're going to do some tag questions. First tag question is please tell us when you were born. I was born October 26, 1961. Are you named after someone? Well, no, I'm not. Uh, my brother wanted a boy when I was born, and he wanted to name me Michael Joe, and my mother, when I come out a girl, my mom said, no, we can do the Joe, but we can't do the Michael. So she come up with Melissa, and my brother named me Joe. Do you love playing sports? Any sports or just watching it? No, I don't play sports. I'm too old for that. My health is too bad, but I do love to watch football. Which one is better, basketball or baseball? Neither. I don't like neither sport. Um, how many do you have children? Yes, I have three. Two girls and a boy. If you have children, what's their name? My son's name's Brad. I've got a daughter named Kelly. And a daughter named Stephanie. Are you married or single and why? I'm single. I'm actually divorced. And because I choose to be, I like it that way. What is your favorite drink of all? Mm, Sun-kissed and sweet tea. Alcoholic beverage, I don't drink very much, but if I do, it would be either a pina colada or a Miami Vice. I like frozen drinks. Do you want a business? I would love to have a diamond painting business, but at this point in my life, I don't think that that's ever going to happen. Um, so I'll just diamond paint in my own house. Do you work? Yes, I do. I'm not working right now because I've been off from having surgeries. I have my last surgery this coming Friday, hopefully, and I can go back to work after the first of the year. If you love snakes, which one is your favorite? I don't like snakes. I don't like snakes at all. Um, how tall are you? And have I ever dreamed of being taller? I'm 5'5", five, five, and no. I'm not, dre never dreamed of being taller. I'm happy the way I am. Uh, have you ever been on a bridge? And do you like bridges? Of course I've been on a bridge. You've had to been in a rock if you've never been on a bridge. I mean, that's just, you're going to have to go over bridges anywhere you go. So, yeah, I like bridges. Have you ever dreamed of being a successful lawyer? No. I would have liked at one point to have been a police officer or a detective. Um, where do you want to travel? I'd love to go on a cruise. That's my only. Or maybe Jamaica. I'd love to go to Jamaica. Maybe a cruise to Jamaica or the Caribbean. Have you ever been to Europe? No? Haven't. I've never been out of the United States. Mm. Do you believe that Trump will make America great again? Oh, yeah. If you don't get impeached first, have you the right to vote in U.S. elections? Yes, I do. And I vote every year. Or every time the election comes up. Mm, what do you think about Russia's leader, P Putin? I don't think anything about him. I don't know the man, so I can't judge him. How would you describe yourself? Mm, 
I'm honest. I'm caring. I'm loyal. I love my family. I love all my friends. Um, what, I'm hard working. Mm, where did they get these questions from? Who, who do you admire the most, your mother or your father? Well, I admire my mother the most because she raised me. She was my best friend. I didn't know my father, unfortunately. I did know him. I knew him as my father, but I didn't know him, you know, as far as being in my life, really. He passed away when I was 22. Do you have siblings, and how many? Yes, I have many. I had one bl real blood brother. He passed away in 2012. I have two half-sisters, and I've got multiple stepbrothers and stepsisters. How many books have you read in the last year? 20. <laughs> Or more. I used to read a whole lot before I started diamond painting, but since I started diamond painting, I hadn't picked up a book. Which smartphone do you use, iOS or Android? iOS. I have an iPhone. Who is your favorite male YouTuber? Um, Jeremy, JTM, J Crafts. Uh, who's your favorite female YouTuber? That, by far, would be Diamond Art Addiction, Sherry. I'm an admin in her group. I followed her. Since I've been diamond painting, I think she was the first person that I ever followed. She encouraged me to start my channel. So it's Diamond Art Addiction all the way. Even though I do like other YouTubers, but she's my favorite. Can you remember the first time laughed? Mm, no, not really. Can you remember the first time you felt angry? Yes, I can. And I'm not going to go any further with that. Um, when was the last time you cried? Last night, when I lost all the videos for this collab, for the kitten up. What is your favorite moment from your childhood? Um, beach trips. Yeah, beach trips. Have to be our family vacations to the beach. Do you have pets? No, I don't, unfortunately. What is your favorite burger and why? My favorite burger is a double cheeseburger. And I don't know why. Do you prefer Coke or Pepsi? Coke out of a fountain, Pepsi out of a can. What activity do you do only when you are alone? What kind of question is that? <laughs> um, diamond paint? Because that's all I do. <laughs> I don't know what kind of question that is. If it were possible, would you change your race or gender? No, I'm happy with who I am. What will you do if you had a million dollars? Stop that. What would you do if a million dollars was given to you with no strings attached? I would buy me a house and a new car. And I would buy my kids all a house and a new car. No, I wouldn't buy them a new car. 
I'd buy all my grandbabies that's old enough a new car, and then I'd put enough away to live on the rest of my life. Hmm. It's big dreams. What are your top pet peeves? My top pet peeve is for a man to leave the commode lit up. Ugh. I guess that's one of the reasons I'm single. What is the one activity ho or hobby that you cannot do without? Go figure, diamond painting. What, if you could change one thing about yourself, what would it be? I don't, I don't know if I would think of anything or would change anything if I could. I mean, I, I'm comfortable being me. So, I don't know. I don't, I don't think there's one thing I would change about myself. If you could remember one lesson and take it into your next life, what would that be? To live it each day as if it, it's your last and enjoy it to the fullest because it might it, who knows at any point it could be your last moment so enjoy life what would you want to be written on your tombstone huh. nine of seven that's right because my grandbabies are the joy of my life. There's not nothing that I enjoy being more than being a grandmother or nana to my seven grandbabies, even though they're not all li so little anymore. Would you rather be the best looking or smartest girl at your school? Well, since I ain't been school in a long time, I'd rather be the smartest because looks are only skin deep. Uh, what do you think other people love about you? Uh, I don't know. Maybe my honesty. What is your favorite holiday of the year and why? I think my favorite holiday of the year would be Thanksgiving because that's the only time of the year that all of my family gets together, and that's my entire family. Mm. What name would you give your baby if it were a girl? Well, my first girl, I give her the name Kelly. What name would you give your baby if it was a boy? My first baby, his name was Brad, Bradley. But it's been shortened over the years to come down to Brad. What movie have you watched the most and why? Uh, I think the notebook, just because of the sense of what a long-lasting relationship could be or should be, just, just the commitment in that movie just is beyond me. What was your proudest moment? I think the proudest moment of my life, I have seven of them, and that's when all seven of my grandbabies were born. I was there for six of them, but I didn't get to be there with the rest, of, with the other one, because I was in the hospital. I'd fell and broke my arm and had to have surgery myself. When I woke up, the doctor told me that I had a new grandson. 
Uh, where would you live if you had to move? If I had to move, I don't know where I'd live. Um, I'd like to live in Florida on the beach. What celebrity would you date if you could? Charlie Hoonan, Sons of Anarchy, all the way. What keeps you up at night? My brain. I can't shut it off. I wished I had my brain. My brain had an on-off switch on it. If you could choose any three cars to drive, what would they be? A Honda Accord. A Honda Sonata. Or a Ford Mustang. Would you want to be a guy or girl in your next life? I want to be a girl. Why would I want to be a guy? What's more important, the journey or the destination? The journey. Without a doubt, it's the journey. I think we might have time for one more question. What does the perfect day look like to you? Um, probably 70 degrees, sunshiny, walking in the sand on the beach. Yeah. Then to get to see that sunset at night. I don't ever get up to early enough to see the sunrise, so it was the sunset. What is the biggest thing that girls do that annoys you? Whine. Well, it looks like I'm probably fixing to be finished up here. So, hope you guys have a blessed day and enjoy this video.